a cigarette, a car backfire, small sparks can make big fires. In San Francisco a carelessly discarded cigarette, a downed power line, a car's backfire or a chainsaw's pull. Just about anything could have started any one of the wildfires now tearing through Northern California, authorities said. Ken Pinlot who is the state's top firefighter said that every spark is going to ignite a fire. Also he said that the risk remains extreme for new starts. Ken Pinlot said that at Tuesday investigators are looking into the causes, but no determination has been made at any of the 17 sites of major wildfires blazing in Northern California. Pinlot, the California Department of Forestry and Fire Protection Director, said 98% of all wildfires are started by people and it's unlikely lightning is to blame for any of the fires that exploded overnight Sunday, killing at least 17 people so far. California's most dangerous wildfire season comes in autumn, when summer heat and insects have left brush dead and dried out, and winds are especially hot, dry and strong. Ken Pimlot said that this is traditionally California's worst time for fires. Ken Pimlot said firefighters typically respond to 300 blazes a week during this season, but nearly all are extinguished quickly and with minimal damage. However, conditions were ripe for wildfires in California wine country after record rains last winter created an abundance of dry vegetation which combined with low humidity and unusually high winds gusting to 79 miles per hour to create fast-moving infernos. They are spread over a 200-mile region north of San Francisco from Napa in the south to Redding in the north, taxing firefighting resources. The U.S. Department of Defense is sending a large drone to help map the fires and assess damage. The biggest and most devastating fire is burning in Santa Rosa, a city of 175,000 people 45 miles north of San Francisco. A fire there swept through several neighborhoods and business districts, destroying at least 550 homes and 21 commercial buildings. Many residents had only minutes to flee. Eleven of the 17 fatalities found so far have occurred in and near Santa Rosa. De Rosa, 